Hello and welcome everybody, this is Alan Herdemian, aka the fire puller himself, aka the fire spitter, the fire smoker, and everything in between coming to you here live from Vegas, baby, Vegas. It is about 5 o'clock my time, that is about 8 o'clock Eastern time, and somewhere in between, well it's somewhere in between, but we are all here ready to get started with, this will be the third uh, mixer with the fire puller on Topps Gallery. This will be the second one that we have done on eBay. If you look, we've got eight blasters, three megas right back there, and then we've got 12 uh, fat packs right here. Dylan, welcome to the party. Welcome to the show. Dylan is a new member of the room, compliments of eBay, so hopefully we'll be able to pop your fire puller cherry in style. Um, for those of you that do not know me, I am the fire puller. I am unique. I am not a shop. I am not a business. I'm just a collector, just like you guys. I do this to have some fun with you guys, but uh, fair warning. Uh, my videos are rated R for language and adult humor. So, and you're very welcome, Dylan. Welcome to the party, man. Hope, hopefully you enjoy the show. I mean, that's what I try to tell people. We're here to have fun. I mean, breaks are, unfortunately, they're a form of gambling, and you're not going to win every time. But at least if you have some fun while you're doing it, it's kind of worthwhile. But uh, we do things a little different in here. So number one, number one, most important thing, Please, 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 if you've got little kids around that shouldn't be listening to some cussing and some ball busting, then please lower the volume on your feed. That's it. Um, if you're watching with the kiddos and they're not old enough to know what 420 stands for, you might want to watch the recap. That's the warnings. That's the disclaimers. Those are the only potential negatives that could possibly come up. Outside of that, flawless. Boom. So, as we saw on the other side of this camera, we have all this stuff. Now, I'm going to make some space because I got to move some stuff. So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to start piling up my blasters. Okay? We're going to move our eight blasters to the side real quick. And then we're going to clear up. Whoop, there we go. We lost one. Clear up these three megas, and as you see, there are three piles. One, two, and three. Those three piles that you see there are there to be revealed at the end of this break. What I do with those is I do trivia. So I like to make this break entertaining. There are a lot of dead spots in the break when we're opening packs, and goddamn Topps Gallery really... Took the cake on this one with 29 freaking billion packs to open up. But at the end of the day, when I'm kind of on my downtime, that's when I'm going to try to pass the time with some trivia with you guys. Um, now we see the cards. Uh, this is, I'm going to count them out because I know we're on eBay and there are some skeptics on eBay. Anytime you <laughs> deal with somebody, that's six. And this is seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. I'm just kidding. 11 and 12. So now you see that. Occasionally, during the break, I may flip the camera to celebrate a big hit with whoever gets the big hit. If I flip the camera, you'll see both of my hands. You'll see me. On the other side of this camera is a table and there's a wall. There is nothing that can occur in the midst of me flipping the camera, doing something for you guys, and then flipping it right back. So now we've covered every possible scenario in this break. The only thing left to do, the only thing left to do at this point is have some damn fun. So, got to get prepared. Now I'm prepared in customary fire polar fashion. We're going to get this fire started now and hopefully it never burns out. So from my house to your house, this buds for you. Oh. And let it begin like LeBron. Boom. So here we go. 
We're gonna start, <coughs> we do this in three sections. <coughs> so we're, <coughs> <Ooh. coughs> we're gonna start <coughs> with three, uh, with the packs. So we got 12 packs coming. Oh man, I forgot to dump the garbage. That wasn't too smart. Give me one second. I'm gonna have to get some uh, dumpsters real quick. There are a lot of boxes that come out of this crap. <coughs> All right, so <clears throat> as I'm opening up packs, just for the guys that are new to the fire puller, um, if you do not know, this is Facebook, this is our room. So we have breaks that run on eBay. Um, I run the majority of my breaks on Facebook. Um, when you are on Facebook, pricing is pretty self-explanatory. You have the opportunity at your teams. You don't have to worry about waiting for an auction. But the real benefits of being on Facebook is you are a part of the family. You are not obligated to be here. You are simply here to watch the break because I have learned uh, the feed is much more efficient on Facebook than it is on YouTube to start. On top of that, the upload time of the video, doing a Facebook video and then going to YouTube and dropping it, is literally five minutes. The upload time on a YouTube video done on YouTube to be uploaded to YouTube after it's been live. Get this, a day. Makes no sense, makes no sense whatsoever. But now I'm just like, I'm done with uh, YouTube. I'm doing it here on Facebook. You guys were not tricked to be here. You are allowed and more than welcome to leave if this is not the room and the, the breaker for you. But as most people will learn, it really isn't a better room to be a part of. I also operate one of the safest rooms on Facebook because I am involved in practically everything. And out of a room full of about 750 members, 645 who are active, I am probably friendly and very familiar with over 600. So we keep it small, we keep it close-knit by design. Hopefully you guys enjoy it and you wanna be a part of this group and the family and you can reach out to find out what some of the added perks are to the group. But without further ado, we're gonna get through the uh, packs. When we are done with these cards from the packs, we're gonna do trivia question number one. When we are done with the blasters, we're gonna do trivia question number two. And when we're done with the monster boxes, we'll do trivia question number three. And thank you guys for all the compliments. Love it, love you guys. But here we go. I'm gonna try to go through this. If you've never seen Gallery, I'll go through it slow to start, just so you can see the quality of the cards. Beautiful cards for your PC, but there are so many cards, we try to brush through it and kind of stop off at the spots. There are numbered cards, there are parallels, and there are what I call and consider big name rookies. Big name rookies find their way into top loaders. Mid-level will find their way into penny sleeves, and all the parallels find their way into penny sleeves. It's the only way to do it. So we've got to the Padrinos, Andres Munoz, Chrome Parallel, Nick Solak on the wood, Ryan McMahon on the wood. Then we've got some cards, Sanchez Noose, Zach Collins, Brian Abreu, Azale, Max Scherzer. Then the Masters, this card is Jacob deGrom and Peter Alonzo. We've got Matt Chapman on Modern Artists. And then we've got a Carter Kaboom on the Chrome Parallel. Continuing on, we've got some George Springer on the wood. There we go to the Astros. A little Jordan Alvarez uh, wood rookie card. Adam Hazley, Nico Horner on the uh, rookie. Yamaguchi, Ronald Hakuna Matata. What a wonderful phrase. Blake Snell, Matt Thace, Paul Goldshit, Chris Bryant, Baby Ruth. Beautiful card for the Yankees. That'll find its way in a top loader out of respect. Respect. Little Mookie Betts. Then we got Salvador Perez on the wood. Behind that, we've got Aaron Savali. Nice hit for the Indians. Another Aaron Savali behind it. 
Maldonado, Votto, Hyunjun Ru, Schwarber, K, Cesar. Then we've got Lux and Bellinger. And wouldn't you know, right behind it to the Mariners, we got the kid. It's the kid Capri. Boom. Nice hit for the Mariners. Behind that, we've got Hilliard on the Chrome Rookie. I'm going to take a little break and sleeve up some of these cards for you guys. And then we will get started with uh, Mr. Carter Kaboom on the wood, which is the next card we see. I think I got a busted sleeve. There we go. And we did a mixer earlier today. Nice little spread came out of it. We ended up getting a Fernando Tatis Redemption Auto of the, I think it was the Impressionist or something, the portrait. But... We hit a Lux Orange, one of the other breaks, and we're hoping to we're hoping to see a big boom out of this, if not a couple. But we got Carter Kaboom, Ryan McMahon on the wood, Hazley, Nico Horner, and we got Sean Yamakuchi, Divas, Kluber, Trevor Bauer, whoever, Sam Hilliard, Mr. Teddy Baseball, Vlad Jr., then we got Nick Birdie. And behind Birdie, we've got You Say Kikuchi, I Say Cunt on the wood. Nothing cooking. Aristides Aquino, nice hit for the Rojos. Max Muncy, that's an interesting card. I don't remember seeing this card. I'll put it separately. That might be a parallel. But then we've got Mr. DeGrom, Chapman, Andrew McCutcheon, and Jorge Soler. Then we got Yelly, A.J. Puke on the Chrome Rookie card. Nice hit for the A's. Mr. Tucker. Then we got Maldonado. Yelly, Arenado, and Jordan Luplo. That's a lot of card of kaboom. They just like to hear me say that. But continuing on, we got card of kaboom. Perez, Hayura, Alonzo, Olsen, Derek, Derek, Cheetah, Cheetah, Cheetah. Nice hit for the Yanks. We got Raphael was a diva. Junior Fernandez for the cards. Nothing cooking. Zach Gallon, and we got some green going to the Rockies. Boom. Nice hit for the Rockies. This is Sam Hilliard. This is going to be numbered. And we're going to check it out together. This is number 18 out of 99. Boom. Nice hit for the Rockies. And continuing on, we've got some DeGrom and Alonzo, followed by Roberto Clemente. Beautiful card and another Chrome Yordan. But behind it, we got a Wood Gavin Lux. Boom. Back to back. Can we go back to back to back with big name rookie parallels? Let's see. Back to back to back. Ah, it's a rookie, but it's not a big name. Travis Demerit to the Tigers. And continuing on, we got some Machado, some Logan Webb, Yelly, Bryce Harper, Mr. Freeland, Little, Clevenger, Shinsu Chu, Anthony Rendon to the Mariners. We got a K-Dub, Kyle Lewis. To the Yankees, Mike Talkman, and to the Rays, my man, Brendan McKay. Boom.
And next stack, we've got Luplo, Aquino, Mr. Mike King, Talkman, Seth Brown, Dean Dietz, you're down again. A little Bo Bichette and Roberto Alomar. Boom. Nice card. Right behind it, Mr. Trout, the legend. And we got some Jalen Davis on the chrome, Alex Young, JT Real Muto on the wood, Lane Thomas, Bieber, Andrews, Gonzalez, Miggy, Tanaka. And then we got Merrifield, Syndergaard, the kid, Ken Griffey, Jacob DeGrom, Jalen Davis, and Tommy Edmond on the wood. Bogart, Solak, Sandoval, Robel, Soto, Hakuna, Snell, Face, Goldshit, Bryant, Salvador, and Carter Kaboom on the wood. Shohei, there we go, finally for the Mariners, Kyle Lewis. I'd like to see some color on that, Mr. Kyle, and a little bit of ink. Wouldn't mind seeing a Griffey either. And that, my friends, is the packs. I'm going to start ripping through uh, these boxes in just a second. In each blaster box, there will be no wooden parallels, but instead, they give you four artist proof parallels in each pack. So we have eight blasters, which means we will have 32. 32 artist proof parallels coming out of these blasters i'm going to stack them up as i go we will do the artist proofs at the end but while i'm opening up all this stuff as promised we're going to get to trivia question number one so the topic of today the topic of today where do i go where do I go? And that's the question that a lot of baseball players are asking themselves this offseason. Where do I go? Well, we're going to figure out who those players are that are asking that question. So, trivia question number one. Name that man. Name that man. This free agent led the majors this past season, led the majors in complete game shutouts. What is his name? Led the majors in complete game shutouts. What is his name? Mr. Boom. Mr. Hiker, give me a number. One, two, or three. Mr. Bauer is the correct answer. And Jeff, welcome to the party. Welcome to the show. Good answer. Correct answer. But I had someone right ahead. And that was Mr. Hiker. Just waiting on a number from you. And number two for Derek, Derek, Cheetah. Cheetah, cheetah. So we got number two for you. Let me put these up here. Number two. So after we are done with these uh, blasters, we will do trivia question number two. At the end of the break, once everyone has their uh, prize selected, we will do a reveal on what is behind those doors. I will say, may not be a, a monster card, but I threw in a Topps Chrome Gold of one of the, I'd say he's like a mid-level. He's not, he's not like a star. He doesn't have like a cult following, but he's a rock-solid player that literally just, he does what he's got to do on every team he plays for. He's like a good utility player. 
So I threw that in. I was like, I don't, I don't want to sell it. Let's just put it up. But we've got all these packs to go through. They are a lot of fun opening up. But I promise you, eventually, we run out of packs to open up and we actually get to see some cards. So in the meantime, in between time, while I continue this run, I will let you guys know that we have some other items going up on eBay that should drop uh, Sunday. So National Treasures obviously is here. Everybody's doing the National Treasures thing. Well, we have a couple cases coming in and we will too. So with the National Treasures stuff, uh, you will see on Sunday. Sunday night will begin the auction. It'll be a five-day auction to end next Friday, um, breaking next Saturday, just so we don't have a, any <laughs> nightmares with the uh, unpaids. But we will break Saturday of next week, and I should be able to put up another case at some point in the middle of the week. Yeah, I don't remember that being colorful. But at some point in the middle of the week, I'll throw up another case of National Treasures. We'll have a couple cases on eBay. We'll also have a case or two in the room. We'll have Bowman Chrome dropping. Uh, well, I was supposed to do it tonight, but I don't think that's going to happen. So we're going to probably drop Bowman Chrome tomorrow. Uh, at some point, I'd say about 1, 1 to 2 p.m. Eastern. Once it fills, we will break it. But we've got that, and I also got my hands on some fun stuff for the guys that don't want to spend a ton of money and just want to get a couple cards and have some fun. We will be doing pack wars, we will be doing uh, divisional breaks, and uh, we will do random team breaks on uh, Panini Contenders draft picks for the baseball, as well as I got my hands on some Bowman Platinum mega boxes today one auto per box and pretty much the same checklist that everybody's been chasing on 2019 bowman draft and 2020 bowman so a lot of big names for a very very inexpensive value I'm not saying you're gonna hit a million dollar card it's not it's not prism it's not uh, whatever this craziness of basketball is, but it's one of those things where you get these cards at an affordable rate, and I don't care. If I only got to spend $100 to get a Jason Dominguez auto, I'll be happy. Don't know if $100 will get a Jason Dominguez auto, but it's one of those things where that's why I buy Leaf. I want to have every top name and not have to spend thousands of dollars to get them. Bowman Platinum is definitely a product for that. But we will have all that stuff filling, all that stuff breaking. I still have personals for the football and basketball heads. Most that uh, know me already know, I don't know shit about basketball or football, but I stock it up in the retail side. So if you ever want them, I got them. And no, Jared, no big Braves as of yet. No big Braves. But we are early. We got through the light stuff. Now we're on to the heavy stuff. And we got at least a Louis Robert for the White Cox. Hope, hopefully we can stack up some more Robert's, Lux, Bichette, Jordan, and Mr. Kyle Lewis. The only drawback to this set, as I mentioned in the last break that I did, no Randy Arizarena. No Arizarena in the checklist. Imagine if he was. Don't know which, which uniform he'd be wearing for this set, but... I'd love to see an Ares Arena in this set. We'll see it next year. Oh, yeah. 
Well, an onyx is the same thing. Onyx, though, is... I don't know what it is, man. They don't grade at all. Like, they won't grade onyx, period. Like, I got two cards that were both onyx cards, like, literally, pack fresh, and they would not grade them. They said something. I don't really look at the little slips that they give, but they said something on them. And that... I don't know if it was just because of the cards I sent or if it's literally all of Onyx, but one of the big things I didn't like about the Onyx is how the cards stick together. Like, they don't use a good coating on the cards, so when you're opening those packs, like, half of them are, like, stuck together, like, pretty damn good. So when you do get the random gem out of that, that's worth that much more. We've got 4,000 more packs to go, and then we'll be able to see some cards. Again, this is the blaster section of the break. So we have finished the fat packs. Got a little bit out of it. Nothing crazy. But we are hoping to see some good motherfucking shit out of these blasters. Want some surprises. There we go. We got a Bichette. We've got a Bichette sighting. My favorite rookie from the class. Bye, Bichette. Bye, Lux. Bye, Lewis. Bye, every single one of them. Even Robert, no matter where they are priced right now, Buy up rookie cards. Buy them all. Three, five, eight. Block. Marsha, the packs did not do good for really anybody, to be honest. So we're, we're just getting started. The packs, I don't even think we got numbered in the packs. Maybe we did, but I'll show you guys. I mean, we got Robert uh, Bichette. It's just basically rookies and base. Uh, McKay on the parallel. That was the best hit, I would say, for uh, the Dodgers. Uh, Jeter. Oh, there we go. For the Rockies, we got a Hilliard rookie card out of 99. But that was it. So those are our, those are our notables thus far. And we're trying to add on some more, Marsha. So we'll, we'll get you back up to par. I know without about three monsters, is it's not a typical Marsha break. Marsha, Marsha, Marsha. You did so damn well the other day i was so happy those cards absolutely beautiful triple threads is one sharp product and i said you did you did bad in the first one i had a feeling you had to do good in the second like there's no way you're gonna have two inners of the same case without a couple big bombs or a couple dodgers thrown in there <laughs> Thank you, Marsha. <laughs> I got jokes. All right, we are down to 30 packs to open up. Almost there. Now uh, we're down about four or five, and we are ready to roll. So I thank you guys for your patience. Come on, I'm hoping we get some uh, autos out of these. We got a couple. Actually, yeah, I guess we did get a good amount out of the blasters. Because we got a couple in the first run. We got a couple in the second run. Let's see if we can uh, keep up the pace. So good luck to everybody. <laughs> ah, we are finally through those damn packs. Hallelujah. Lord have mercy, Jesus. Well, here we go. These are the blasters. Good luck to you guys. That's right. Springer, nothing cooking. Shohei, Bueller. We got more Yordan. There are a lot of Yordans. 
And we got him. These cards are nice. The Master and Apprentice, they got a different finish. I never even felt it. But that was uh, Big Poppy and Mr. Divas. Then we got Kyle Lewis. And we got some nonsense. Clevenger on the chrome. Nothing cooking. Mike Shit on the Hall of Fame. Elvis Andrews on the chrome. Buster Poser. TJ Zook. That's a little Eloy. Mike Trout. Could tell for the Cardinals. Quang Young Kim. Great, great pitcher. And there it is. Wow. Three in one pile. Boom. Nice hit to the Mariners. Throw in a chrome as well. We didn't get you the wood, but maybe we'll get you an artist proof, Kyle Lewis. That was a nice little uh, run for the Mariners. And that's what this kind of product is. This is where you just stack up on your rookies, send in the ones that are centered, get those gems, and watch your money pile up. Not much risk, but with the right spots, a lot of reward. And continuing on, we've got some Alzale, and we got a Bichette coming. Bobo. Nothing cooking. Abreu. Divas and Big Poppy. We got a Chrome Toro. Nothing cooking. We got Nolan Ryan, the Express Train. Boom. Nothing cooking. Aaron Nola, Andres Munoz, Anthony K, Shinsu Chu, wasting a parallel. Nothing cooking. Glaber Torres and to the Angels. Mr. Shohei Otani. And then Mr. Luplo. Nice hit. All right, and here we go. Next stack, we got Yelly for the Brew Crew. That was on the Chrome. Shinsu Chu, nothing cooking. Bryce Harper, nothing. Yelly again. AJ puked. Mike Yaz, Charlie Blackman was a white man. Logan Webb, Toro, McNeil, Vado, Machado, Blackman again. Gonzalez. We got Tony Gwynn and Fernando Titties. Boom. Love me some titties. Eric Hosmer, Anthony Rizzo, Baby Ruth. Beautiful card. Nothing cooking. Francisco Lindor. We got Pablo Lopez on the chrome coming up next. Pablo Lopez. And looks like we got some color coming. We got some blue coming. That could be a 50 print. Could be a 50 print. It will not be this card. Jordan Alvarez. George Springer. And look at that. You ask and you shall receive. Marsha, Marsha, Marsha. Marsha, you have been crushing gallery. With the Dodgers. Ah, oh, 99. They robbed us. I thought that was 52. That's what the one weird thing about this set. Color does not mean anything when it comes to print. Different parallels have different numbers of the set based on the color. But still, beautiful card. Centering's real nice. Sandy Koufax numbered out of 99. Boom.
and your Don number 3000. And continuing on, all rise. The Honorable Aaron Judge is in the building. We got Raphael was a diva. Kemp. <coughs> Nothing cooking. Gwen and titties. We got Jose Altuve on the chrome. Nothing cooking. Flaherty, Mustakis, Steven Gonzalez on the chrome. Gary, I can't hit the ball, but I can get it over the wall. Sanchez. Mr. May, nothing cooking. Jackie Robinson, enough said. Nothing cooking. We got a Lux. We got Altuve. Nothing cooking. Michael Jordan. We got a Chrome parallel of Mr. Shane Bieber. No relation to Justin. And we got Trevor Richards. Gonzalez, whoop, Gonzalez to the mutts. I knew that looked funny. Gonzalez to the mutts. Whoever's got the mutts, congratulations. This one is numbered out of 25. Mr. Gonzalez for the New York mutts. Fourteen out of twenty-five. Nice hit. Mm -mm -mm. Now, if that had been an Alonzo, I'd be a little more excited. But still, anything out of twenty-five in anything licensed to me worth all the money or as much money as you can get out of it. But Brendan McKay, we got some upside down cards. Glaber Torres, Alex Bregeman, nothing cooking, nothing, Jordan and Bre uh, Bagwell, back to upside down, we've got KB, Ryu, run, Ricky, run, for the A's, Mr. Bieber, Paul Goldshit, and to the Cubbies, nice hit for the Cubbies, beautiful card, master and apprentice, Ron Santo and Chris Bryant. I don't know if Tim got into this break, but I really hope he did. Tim, I hope you are the uh, <laughs> owner of the Cubbies. Because this would be a beautiful card for your collection. Numbered out of 250, doesn't matter. Mr. Santo and the story behind him. That would be beautiful. But here we go. We got Lane Thomas. Hakuna Matata. What a wonderful phrase. The express train. Nothing cooking. We got some Soto, baby. Nick Solak. Then we got Robo Garcia on the chrome. Nothing cooking. Nothing. We got a little n -n 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 Nico. And nothing. Breggy Man, Louis Robert, and the Big Hurt. Boom. Nice hit for the White Cox. Then we got Nico. Tugger, nothing. Johnny Bench for the Rojos. Nothing there. We got some titties. Then we got Eric Hosmer on the chrome. Andres Munoz. Let's see what's next. Another stack. Alonzo, Olsen, Breggy Man, Nothing Cooking, Keston Ayuda. Then we got Roberto Alomar and Bo Bichette for the Blue Jays. Boom. Nice hit. Got Strowman, McMahon, Carter Kaboom, Hunter Harvey on the Chrome, Severino. Nothing. Run, Ricky, run again. Anthony Rizzo on the chrome. Kim again. Nice hit for the Cardinals. Nola Munoz, Scherzer, Marte, 
Rizzo again on the Chrome, then Agrizal, and last stack Mojo. We've got Abreu, Alzale, Paul Goldschit, Stroman, Boyd, Collins, the Dodges, Kershaw and Bueller, Severino, nothing, Akiyama to the Blue Jays. Nice hit. Chrome parallel, Bo Bichette. Beautiful centering, too. I give it a 10. Very nice. Just beautiful cards. Jonathan Villar, Kyle Tucker, Jake Rogers, The Sandman, Vlad Jr., Mangdon, Titties, Brandon McKay on the Chrome, and J.D. Martinez. And now, my favorite part of the break, the Artist Proofs. 32 Artist Proofs about to pop. We are looking for legends. We are looking for rookies. And when we see legends or rookies, we are only looking for the best of the best. So hopefully we will have some monster proofs coming out of here. And then we'll be primed for those three mega boxes right there. Six autos guaranteed. And I just have a feeling, I have a feeling we're going to see a legendary auto coming out of one of those. Because this is it. No more gallery. Well, we got something for the personal mixer at the end of the month. But no more gallery breaks. Next break we're dropping is going to be a hobby, uh, hobby break of Bowman Chrome. Pick your team full case break. That'll be here on Facebook. And then Sunday you will see the break on eBay for National Treasures. But we've got all eight packs opened up. Let's get this party started. Good luck to everybody. We got Demerit. Nick Birdie, Karinkic, Stroman, Manny Machado, Logan Webb, Yelly, Marte, Andrews, Kemp, All Rise, Aaron Judge, Lindor, Jesus Lazardo, Colin Moron, Zach Gallen, Thames, Real Muto, Jalen Davis, Aaron Savali. Yeah. He's a killer. And we got Mr. Springer. You say Kikuchi. I say cunt to the Dodgers. I told you. I told you, Marsha. You don't listen to me. Garrett Cole. Jordan Montgomery. Ozzy Albies. Ryan Yarbrough. J.D. Martinez. Vlad Jr. Max Scheiser. Cattell Marte. Nice hit for the Cardinals. Quang Young Kim. And Mr. Yelly closing it out. A lot better quality on these artist proofs. And now, time to open up another 5,000 packs. But in the meantime, in between time, while I keep this rhyme, we are going to go to giveaway number two. Giveaway number two while I get this started. So giveaway number two is going to be a simple one. And actually, before we get to giveaway number two, let me just explain how these monster boxes work. Okay? 
two, ad two autograph cards per box. There are 100 cards total. They lied to you. There's 101 because there is a box topper as well. The box toppers, as you will have possibly seen in the title of, the, of some of the listings, there is a potential of a one of one because these box toppers can be signed by the artists who actually did the cards. So we will have three box toppers that we'll go over right at the end. But each box has 20 packs, so needless to say, we're gonna be here for a while. Get comfortable. If you gotta use the bathroom, go to the bathroom. If you gotta smoke a cigarette, go smoke a cigarette. And if you gotta take a crap, well, you know, just make sure you mute the phone. But anyway, we've got Six autos coming up. We still have two total giveaways to go through. And at the end, we'll reveal everything right before we do the recap. But we are on to giveaway number two. So giveaway number two, this MVP candidate qualifies as the best first, second, and third baseman. Third baseman, not third baseman. Third baseman in the free agent pool. Spelling does count. I want his first and last name. Spelling does count. MVP candidate qualifies as the best first, second, and third baseman in the free agent pool, and you better spell his name right. We got 60 packs, actually. 60 packs ready to go. Woo! Have to make a pile somewhere. There we go. Twenty guys here. Damn, Charles! Isan Diaz? God damn, who let Charles in this room? We need security in this motherfucker. Isan Diaz? Isan Diaz? I don't even think he played baseball. DJ LaMethieu. That must be the crackhead version. Now, I didn't go over the disclaimers, but first, I do need the full name. But when you do uh, spell check or incorrectly, you are normally disqualified. Uh, but to spread some love within the new family, I got the correct spelling. And I'm going to give Jeff, because I didn't clarify, Jeff is going to get Giveaway number two. So, Jeff, I'm going to go out on a limb and say Stoop is your last name. I might be wrong. If I am, I apologize. I don't like butchering people's last names because, as you can see, mine is very butcherable, if that's English. But, DJ LeMayhew is the correct answer. Jeff is my winner. I need a number one or three from you, Jeff. One or three. And I apologize in advance. I really have no rhyme or reason to how I'm opening these up. So there will be six total autos that pop out of here, and there will probably be three private issue cards. Private issue cards. And I got you set up, Jeff. Number one. And no, and like I said, he put in the full name, Jared. So I got him on the full name. I got him on the spelling. I just didn't get him on the technicality that when you answer a question incorrectly, uh, you're kind of null and void, but... We're going to keep you in there, Jeff. Jeff, do me a favor. Uh, let me know what team you occupy in this break. What team do you occupy in this break, my friend?
We got a Lou Bob. Oh, you were the man, huh? A man of my own heart. I think I'm in love, Jeff. White Cox, Yanks, and the Tribe. Boom. Showing some love. Let's give this man a little bit of love. All right, one, two, three. Well, let me get that shit out of there. I'm sure you'll have enough of those. One, two, three, four, five. And six, seven, eight. All right. Jeff, give me a number one through eight. One through eight. Whenever you get a chance, just because you bought the hot spot, which is my boys, the Yankees. This is the only, only spread of gallery. And I mean, I had a ton of gallery. Only spread of gallery where I do not have the Yankees. And I sincerely, sincerely hope you get the Yankee that I've been chasing. Because I said, I got to get at least one of these motherfuckers. Derek Jeter or Mariano Rivera. But number five. Number five. Here we go. One, two, three, four. That'll be added to your package, my friend. Thank you for playing. That is not your giveaway. That's just an added bonus from my Jeter stack. Just because, coincidentally, the guy that had the Yankees won a trivia question. Forget about it. You know those guys. They know the, they know the Yankees. They, they got brains. They don't like the Yankees, man. Forget about them. They're shit for brains. Boom. But... <laughs> We, we are about halfway through the green mile. Walk in the mile. Walk in the green mile. And we will be done with all these damn cards in just a minute. We should have, if this works out, we should have three autos in each pile. But I know that shit ain't going to happen. It's going to be like four and one. Two in another, or six in one, and zero in the other. Mr. Brady Rap is in the building. Rap City, y'all. Rap, Rap City. And you're very welcome, Jeff. And just an FYI to anybody that may have commented to me while I'm opening cards. With Facebook, it is not like YouTube. I am not able to see the comments while I'm live if I turn off the comments to look at the cards. So I do these breaks through the camera. So I'm looking at the same thing you guys are looking at. Um, so most of the time when I'm actually sorting through the cards, I don't see any of the comments that come through. So I know a lot of people are like, you didn't see my comment? Like, no, I didn't see your comment. We go over this every time. I didn't see your comment. You could always message me that very comment and I could always address it if you message me. But if you don't message me, I probably won't address the comment I never saw. Boom. So we are almost there, guys. So the way we're going to break this down, we're going to open up all these cards. And after we see all these cards and all six autos, we're going to cross our fingers, pray to baby Jesus first, pray to the card God second, Pray to baby Jesus again, and we're going to open up those uh, three box toppers because my other objective was in the damn near, that that is 20, in the 20 boxes, I wanted to get at least one, one of one. I don't care if it's a card, a box topper, something. Got to give the fire puller his due. But we are fortunate enough to have one of the guys in the room that's in this break, actually. He was one of the lucky guys. He didn't hit it with me, but I don't know if he got it from his own box or if he uh, he was in a break somewhere. But he got one of the uh, sketch cards. 
And sketch cards are one of one, autographed by the actual, uh, the, the artist. And apparently the artist himself is all over Facebook, so he actually reached out to him and told him all types of stuff. It was a Trey Turner. Might just see that Trey Turner become a one of one doubled. Did you, Dylan? What'd you get? Fire Puller loves him some rarities. Wow, good stuff. So there are printing plates. And see, I, I was curious. I said, I don't, I don't even know what they would do in uh, retail. I'm, I'm messing with retail. This is my first, I'd say, three months messing with it. I never touched retail before. I always, I bought into the high-end breaks. I wasted <laughs> tons and tons of money. Blew thousands. Cashing out my annuities. <laughs> Fuck. Don't even want to know. But hell yeah, Walker Bueller. I love Walker Bueller. He's a monster. And Duke Snyder. Holy Jesus criminy. Congratulations, Dylan. Duke Snyder cut auto from gallery. Now, is it just a cut auto or is it like a card with the cut auto on it? Now, I'm wondering how they would do a cut auto for a uh, gallery. I'd love to see it. If you ever get a chance, send me a picture. Like this set, I, I literally, I bought this stuff mainly for me. The problem is I got to break it before I rip it. Because if I don't get the card I want in box number one, I'm at box number 12 before I realize what the hell just happened. And I'd be at box number, there's none left, because all I wanted is a Jeter out of this. Has the auto, so it's a card with the auto. Like it's an actual picture, it's not just like a, a, a check or something that he signed. But here we go. We've got the Megas, good luck to everybody. Comments are off. We got the Kid Capri. Nothing cooking. Akiyama. Mariano. Mr. Simmons. Then we got Gary Sanchez. Chrome. Nick Solak. Nothing cooking. We got some titties. All rise. Nothing. There we go. To the Marlins. Marlins getting on the board. Matt Kemp, private issue. This one is numbered out of 250. Private issues, I found out on the break before this one, are numbered out of 250. I've been putting them in sleeves. I've been putting them aside. I've been giving them away. Then come to find out, <laughs> they're numbered out of 250. I'm like, God damn it. And next stack, we should pop an auto out of one of these. McMahon, kaboom. Salvador Perez, Baby Ruth, Nico Horner. Nothing. We got some titties. Modern artists. Whoop, oh, wrong pile. And we got Hazley, Rizzo, Bo Bichette, Sale, Jordan and Bagwell, Votto, Lindor, Hosmer, to the Brew Crew, Keston Ayuda. And right behind it, to the Astros, Brian Abreu, rookie card auto. Nice hit for the Astros. One of the better pitchers to be pulled in this, as far as for them. And we got to sleeve up some Bichette and some Baby Ruth. Hey. 
And continuing on, we've got some Maldonado, Springer, Edwards, to the Cardinals. Beautiful card. Yachty, Impressionists, not numbered, but Vlad Jr., Savali, nothing. We got more Jordan, more Koufax, Jalen Davis, nothing cooking. We got Shane Bieber on the chrome. Jackie Robinson. Mm -mm -mm. Beautiful cards. Nothing cooking. Whit Merrifield, the Mutts, Montgomery, K, Hernandez, Marwin. We've got Walker Bueller, Mr. Cole, Bryant, Ryu, Schwarber, and Mr. Alonzo for the Mutts. <coughs> Behind that, we've got a little bit of Lux. Nothing cooking. Paul Goldschick. Yachty. Artisan, that's a parallel. Mr. Soto, Hakuna Matata. And to the Twinkles, Mr. Jose Berries. Private issue numbered out of 250. Good feeling next season he is going to continue to impress. Continue to impress. And I might need a minute to get some more sleeves. There are a lot of sleeves on gallery, at least when I do it. Hey, the cards are too pretty not to sleeve them. All right, we are back, and here we go, continuing on, next stack, looking for some boom, we got some bullshit, then we got those guys, nothing cooking, we got Chrome, Matt Olson. not what we want to see, nothing cooking, McKay, Talkman, or Canley, my bad, nothing, you're done. Nothing cooking, and we got green coming up. Make it pretty. Make it pretty. Don't let us down. Chrome Andrews, and to the Mariners, you say Kikuchi, I say cut, and this one is numbered out of 99. Boom. Nice hit for the M's. And this one, this one is an eBay one of one. Boom. How do you like that, Mr. Kikuchi? Boom. Nice hit for the Mariners. Continuing on, Mr. Alonzo, we've got some Bagwell. Thorpe, Mr. Kaboom. Gallon on the rookie, or on the chrome. Mr. Moncada, nothing cooking. We got some nonsense. Mr. K-Dub. Sale. Joey Bato. And Shohei Otani. Continuing. Hosmer. Nothing. Yelly. Ah, oh, I thought that was going to be another auto. We got Chrome behind Yelly. Jordan, number 17,000. Springer, Stewart, Rendon, Posey. Brown, we got green coming. Looks like a Hall of Famer. To the Cubbies, Ryan Sandberg. Boom. 
Nice hit for the Cubbies. They got the Rhino. They got Santo. I think Santo was with Nico Horner. No, it was KB. That's right. Chris Bryant. But numbered out of 250. Nice hit for the Cubbies. Boom. Closing out this stack. We've got more color. Oh, no, that's those stupid artists. But Bellinger, Munoz, these guys. Whoop. Yep. Syndergaard, Talkman, Junior Fernandez for the cards. We got Bichette and Alomar, Dario, nothing cooking, Whit Merrifield, Bo Bichette for the Blue Jays. Nothing, nothing. We got Chrome Divas. Oh, there it is to the Rockies. Kyle Freeland. Nice hit for them. Not numbered, but nice little auto. Some of them are flipped upside down. Some of them are straight up. There is no rhyme or reason to anything these guys do at Tops anymore. Let me get some of these rookies sleeved up. And we still got one stack of high society. So all you guys that may not have hit just yet, don't give up hope. Up with hope and smoke some of my dope. But here we go. Looking for some boom. We know the cards. We know what we're looking for. Give it to us. How's about that for the Nats? Mr. Soto. Boom. Nice chrome hit for the Nats. Doesn't get no better than him. Get a nice auto of Soto. That'll make somebody's day, I'm sure. But continuing on, we got some Dodges. We got a Quino. Nothing cooking. We got some titties. Love me some titties. Divas, nothing. And going to the Angels, Patrick Sandoval. Rookie card numbered out of 99. Boom. Nice hit for the Angels. I know they're looking for a trout. Continuing on. Nothing cooking. Junior, you say Kikuchi, I say cut. Look at that card. Come on. Really? That is beautiful. Willie Mays Hayes, Yelly, McCullers, Loose, Moran, Eloy, nothing cooking. I swear, I've opened up so many boxes. Some of these cards I, I don't think I've ever seen. Dustin May, Alomar and Bichette. We got Machado, Moreland, Reese to the Bravos. Hakuna Matata. What a wonderful phrase. And then we've got James Karinchik to the Indians. Boom. All right, continuing on. We've got some green. Second card over there. But let's see if we can get something better beforehand. How's about to the Gigantis? A little Mauricio DeBond, private issue, numbered out of 250. Boom. That was one of the uh, unpaid spots. So congratulations to somebody in the family 
for picking them up on the bargain bin. Numbered out of 250. Continuing, nothing cooking. Mr. Jordan, Jackie Robinson. We got some Chrome Snell. Loriano, nothing, nothing. We got a K-Dub coming. Mr. Harper, Hakuna Matata. What a wonderful phrase. AJ puked another one. Nice hit, Marsha. Gavin Lux on the chrome. I really, I just love these freaking chrome parallels. I know they're not worth crazy amounts, but they are just sharp. Sparkles in the border, like it really is. This is, they, they made the name right. And if you can appreciate the artwork, that's where this is a set you definitely want. I wouldn't go crazy on it, but I'd probably stock up, make myself a little binder. Next stack, we got green coming. Black man was a white man, Gonzalez Gallo. Buster was a poser. Flaherty and to the Red Cox, Raphael was a diva. This is probably out of 250. Yes, sir. Numbered out of 250. Monster at the plate. Continuing, talking about monsters. How's about Big Mac attack? Andres Munoz. Then we got more people wasting our cards. Mike Trout, whoever, Contreras, Matt Thace on the chrome. The Red Cox, Shaza, Marte, Kim, KB, Stroman, whatever, Azale, Paul Goldshit, Shed Long to the Mariners. Autograph number two for them. I'm hoping Shed Long starts doing some work. I got a lot of Shed Long cards that I'm like, I'm not selling them for that. That dude should be so much better. Next year, next year, Shed. I got faith in you, brother. But next stack. Sevy, Mike Yaz, Bryce Harper, Freeland, Run, Ricky Run, Eloy, Abraham, McNeil, AJ Puked. Oh, damn it. Got my hopes up. Mr. Chipper Jones. Mike King. Charlie Blackman was a white man. Gonzalez. Jesus Lazardo on the chrome. All Rise and the Don Magic Wand. How you like that, Jeff? That's a nice looking card. Boom. Aquino on the rookie. Zook. Jackoff. Mike Mistakis. Javi Baez. Jordan Luplo. Mike Trout. Whatever. Contreras, Lane Thomas on the private issue to the Cardinals. Mr. Turgeon, numbered out of 250. Boom. Last stack mojo. Arenado, Marte, Kim. Logan Webb, the Express Train, Christian Yellick, ah, oh, no, Abreu, Alzale, Shiza, Mr. Lux on the artists, Logan Webb, Akiyama, Matt Boyd, Zach whatever, Tony Gwynn and some titties, Machado, Rogers, whoever, we got some color coming. Colin Moran, and to the Astros again, Lance McCullers Jr. This one, I believe, is numbered out of 50. Numbered out of 50. Boom. Nice hit for the Astros. And the rest of that box... Sheldon Noose, 
Mangdon, Titties, Tucker, Freeman, and Sanchez. And that, my friends, is the end of the cards. We are down to three box toppers. So while I do the uh, box toppers, we're going to get started with trivia number three. Trivia number three. Oh, man, what are we going to do? All right, so disclaimers for trivia number three. Number one, if you've already won a prize, you can answer the question. I will ignore you like you didn't even exist. You will not win again. You can only win one prize per break. Uh, if you are not vested in the break, you cannot win a prize. If you answer incorrectly, any answers to follow your wrong one on one particular question are null and void and do not count, Jeff. So you got away with me missing it. I'm glad to welcome you to the family with a gift. I'm sure there's a couple people that are like, who that Jeff guy, man? He shouldn't have won that shit. I won that shit. But you know what, Jeff? It's all good because that's how we do. Boom. But trivia question number three. This free agent batted 309, and he was the fourth best in the majors with a strikeout rate of 11.4%. One of the only superstars on his team not, not accused of cheating during this scandal. Not accused of cheating during the scandal. And while you guys Google that shit, because you can't figure it out, I'm going to open this up. You guys are all playing for, oh, fuck. What number did Jeff want? Jeff wanted one. Okay, so I got Jeff on number one. So you guys are all playing for envelope num number three. Somehow it always works. The third question is always envelope number three. Woo! Woo! I'm going to run out of motherfuckers to play. First one up, going to Marsha, Marsha, Marsha. That is Mr. Kershaw. Boom. See, now why is this one white? This ain't numbered. I don't remember the other ones being white. Oh, hold on one second. I got to get the sleeves for him anyway. You guys are all wrong, you fucking guys. Nobody ever gets my questions right. I try to do easy ones. I try to make it simple. They still get the motherfuckers wrong. Shit, I guess they are white. Oh, yeah. Beautiful card. I wasn't sure if the uh, corners were the same color, but the corners are. I'm still waiting for a correct answer. It's not George Springer. It's not Yuli Gurriel. Jesus, criminy. Someone that does not strike out a lot and hits over 300 damn near every season he plays. Couple years back, he was one of the best players in baseball. And Charles, you got it, man. How, man, Charles, you're back in my good graces. How the hell did you know it was Isan Diaz? <laughs> I like you already. But nope, nope. Motherfuckers don't even know. He played. There we go. No oh, shit. Motherfucker. J.J. Reddick. Boom. Hitting threes. All right. Now I got to go back. I got to go. <laughs> like fires. <laughs> oh, I like this group. You guys can break anytime. Anytime. But it does not look like Mr. Riker. Mr. Riker did not give me an answer. You are my winner. Michael Brantley is the correct answer. Mr. Riker, you are envelope number three. But first, we are going back. Back 
to the Dodgers. To the Dodgers. Cody B. Marsha, Marsha, Marsha. Look at that man. He's so cool. He's like, man, wait till next year. Watch what I do next year. And I apologize in advance about the oversized uh, sleeves for the uh, box toppers. But unfortunately, finding a 5x7 box topper is a lot easier said than done. And my LCS told me a week ago they'd have it. They didn't have it. So I said, fuck it. Give me those. Got them for half price because they fucked up. But here we go. Last one. Last box mojo. How's this for my man Jeff? Jeff, I know you was like, man, where the fuck is Louis Robert? Where the... Boom. There he is. Who? There he is. Cotton candy, sweet as gold. Let me see Lou Robert. Whoa. To the left. To the left. To the right. To the right. Boom. 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 Nice hit right here. And this thing right here is for my peoples in the streets. Boom. Beautiful card. We're going to light one up for that break. No major, major booms, but really a good spread overall. I thank you guys for participating in that. This Bud's for all you. Boom. <coughs> and now, the moment of truth. The moment the three guys that won the trivia have been waiting for. The reveal. Number one is going to my main man, Jeff. Going to end with the Robert, and you're going to begin with this stack. So, Jeff, this is for you. Henry Owens bullshit. You got a whammy there. This one is numbered out of 150, and behind it, how's that? Definitive D. Gordon, relic patch out of 20. Boom. Not a bad hit for yo spot. So this is going to my man Jeff. Jeff. That was the Yanks. All right, so we got Jeff taken care of. You're very welcome, Jeff. We are on number two. Number two is going to Mr. Boom Hiker himself, one of the lucky recipients of a Jordan Groshans Super Fractor in one of the breaks, one of his first breaks with the Fire Puller, along with an Orange Auto Estevan Florial, both which gemmed. But number two, Mr. Boom, you're going to get my boy, Louis Urias, Allen and Ginter, whatever fucking parallel that is, and then a little Gypsy Queen, Cedric Mullins. I don't know if these are autos. Oh, it's just from one of my stacks. There you go. So Cedric Mullins, that'll go to you, Mr. Boom. Fuck. There we go. And number three. Who's getting number three? Mr. Riker from Riker's Island. That shit crazy motherfucker over these Philadelphia phonies. Here's your prize. Number three. There it is. Scooter Gannett. Tops Chrome. Out of 50. And one of the best closers in baseball, Mr. Josh Haterade, numbered out of 299, on-card auto, tier one talent. That, my friends, 
is the break. Keep an eye out on Sunday on eBay for the National Treasures break to drop. Keep an eye out tomorrow for the Bowman Chrome full case PYT to drop. Also, look for some random games, divisionals, and all types of little bullshit to keep everybody happy and occupied without having to drop all the rent money. But I thank you guys again for watching, participating, and enjoying the show. If you like what you saw, leave feedback for the guy that lists all these things. And make sure it's all positive. The only negative feedback I get, which is he likes people that don't pay, and he smokes weed. Boom. But you guys enjoy your night. Yankees, the best team to ever do it. Derek Jeter, the best player to ever play it. And the fire puller himself, the best breaker to ever break it. Peace and love.